So guys, that's it for the Mark Cuban video, and we'll catch you in the next one. All right. Okay, so for those of you that are sticking around in the live stream, the next thing I wanted to cover is the cost of used cars and why they are so expensive right now. So I'm gonna switch back here to the face cam. Um, used cars, they are very expensive right now. In fact, they are up 15% from just 12 months ago, if you can believe it. And that is pretty crazy, right? So uh, why is that? Why are used cars going up so much in price? Uh, you know, obviously here at the Debt Free Mafia, uh, we're advocates for not having car payments. I push my clients on used cars that they can pay cash for. Uh, and that's a little bit harder to do this year than it was last year. So uh, what, what is that? What's the reason? Well, there's a few different reasons. It essentially comes down to supply and demand. You know, we talk about this a lot. Um, you know, if there's a greater supply of things, usually the cost goes down, uh, the demand goes down. Usually if there's a shorter supply, the demand goes up and the cost goes up. Um, so uh, that's, that's really what it's coming down to. So as you guys know, we're coming out of the pandemic. Um, in the pandemic, there was a huge supply chain shortages that started to happen because workers weren't working to produce parts that those parts that we use to build vehicles. So what's happening is you can even see it sometimes at your local dealership. The local dealerships are actually uh, have a lot less cars than what they normally do. A lot of them do. Yours might not, but ours do here. Uh, I've seen them. They're a little picked over, right? Not only that, um, a lot of people took their stimulus checks and used their stimulus checks as essentially their down payment on new cars also for whatever reason. Um, people said, you know what, we just got a pandemic, uh, went through a minor recession, I'm gonna go buy a brand new car. I don't know where that came from, but um, people thought that. So there's this huge buying surge that we had this last year. Inventory is low on new vehicles, so guess what? Yeah, that makes used cars uh, more expensive. So. There's some good and bad with that. Not only that, there's a issue that's really been driving that. On top of that, and there's a microchip shortage. So as, as you know, most of these new vehicles are uh, smart, uh, right? They have a, a software system that requires microchips. And there's a microchip shortage, again, because of the um, supply issues that we were talking about. So this is really delaying things. I know people who are waiting on vehicles because they don't have this part, right, that they ordered like six months ago. So um, yeah, that's a big issue. So here is the bright side of that. Um, and so you can hear me out here. Um, if you have a car payment and you're not a fan of it and you're wanting to, uh, and you're like, you know what, I'm about this debt-free lifestyle. I wanna get rid of this car payment. I want more cash every month. I wanna be able to do the things I wanna do. I wanna be able to invest more. I wanna be able to fund my emergency fund more, whatever it is, here's your opportunity. I think this is a great opportunity for uh, you if you have a car payment that you're ready to get rid of, sell it. Um, so if you're selling it, you're selling it at a premium right now because there's such a huge demand for used cars right now. Um, and with that, what I recommend doing is before you sell it, let's make sure you got a car in place. So you might be saying, well, it's fine. If I sell it, then I have to overpay for just the next car, the next used car that I find. True, however, what I recommend, and this has worked for my clients, and I really, really strongly recommend this. I would ask you to be open, a little bit vulnerable and humble right here. Ask around, ask your friends, ask Facebook, ask everybody you know, hey, do you have an older vehicle that works that you're not using that I could buy that's not very expensive? It works, guys. I've, I've had clients do this and be able to find, they said, oh yeah, well, we've got my uh, grandmother's vehicle who had passed away uh, and it's not being used anymore and we weren't sure what to do with it. And not only that, if you're sharing that you're on a debt-free journey and that you're selling your car, getting rid of your, pay, uh, your payment, essentially, you know, I think that really goes a long ways too because people really will buy into your story and wanna help if you're just open about it. I know it's not easy because personal finance is a very prideful thing. I get it, I deal with it all the time. But I think this is a really great opportunity for you to sell your used vehicle at a premium, get plenty of cash, use a little bit of that cash. I'd really recommend if you could find a vehicle for less than $3,000, that's really ideal. Uh, they're out there. Again, be sure to ask around. Um, I know it for a fact because I've had clients find them. Um, also, uh, you get a premium for that used car and then all the rest of that money you got left over for that car that's worth more can go towards your smallest debt. Uh, right, we preach debt, debt snowball here. Um, we've got more videos about that if you wanna check it out. But debt snowball, will take all that extra cash from this old vehicle and we'll get a, knock out a big old chunk of debt, if not all your debt from that used car because you'll get rid of your auto loan and you'll get uh, some extra cash, hopefully, if you're right side up on it, um, to be able to pay some stuff off. So that's awesome. So um, 
if we got other options if you're not right side up on your car um, be sure to reach out to a financial coach they'll kind of help navigate you on you know what you should be doing uh, as far as selling a car that you're not right side up on there are some options um, however uh, they sometimes aren't the easiest so um, that's one thing but anyways guys again on that video I just really wanted to or in today's video I really just wanted to help you understand that there's really a lot of ton of opportunity when it comes to your used vehicle with them being um, so inflated right now on price so hope that helps guys guys again if you are down with the debt free vibe go ahead and click subscribe love you to be a part of the debt free mafia uh, if you also want to go over and head over to Facebook uh, facebook.com forward slash debt free mafia love to have you there too we're building some really awesome communities here uh, around debt free lifestyle um, guys I appreciate you thank you so much for stopping by in today's video